Last week, we saw successful summits on Mount Annapurna by 30 climbers from over 10 different countries. We had learned then that Italian alpinist Guillaume Paolo Corona went missing at around 7600 meters but was contacted eventually by aerial radio. Well, there have been more development in the events that took place after the summit. Seems both Guillaume Paolo Corona and Swedish climber Tim Bogdanov went missing on different roads while descending and had to be evacuated from around 6800 meters near Camp 4. Yes, Guillaume Paolo went missing again for the second time when the base camp lost contact with him. When the rescue helicopter spotted him, he was walking on a different road. Fortunately, both the climbers are safe and stable in Kathmandu Hospital now, although have suffered frostbites. It has to be noted that both the climbers submitted Annapurna without supplemental oxygen or any Sherpa support. On the mighty Mount Everest, it has been a snowy weekend in the Everest base camp. While few teams climb up to as far as Camp 3 as part of the acclimatization hikes, few other teams are a little relaxed and just crossed Kumbu Icefall. Sherpa teams are waiting to fix the ropes above Camp 4 and are hopeful to open the road to the top of this week, making the season's first summits on Mount Everest. Meanwhile, the number of permits issued by the Nepal Tourism Department for Mount Everest has gone up to 316 now. While in Makalu, we learned that teams are busy in acclimatization hikes at different camps. Few teams have even gone up till Camp 4 at 7650 meters as part of the acclimatization hikes. And in Kanchanjunga, ropes have already been fixed till Camp 4. Looks like one team, part of Pioneer Adventure, has already left base camp for summit push while another team will leave base camp tomorrow.